Hello everyone, and this is a short review about um, Threadfire, which is the latest version now. Um, I don't have internet connection now, I have just unplugged my um, connection uh, so that I can fix something wrong. But it's totally updated, and I'm using a Windows 7 machine. This is my um, host computer. Um, it's Windows 7. So let's start here. Um, after the installation, um, Threadfire will run a scan if you have an antivirus protection, spyware or, ma or malware protection including the firewall and it will say that um, you have to download this to fix this problem you have to download um, PC tools antivirus something like that but we're not gonna do that just since just just a threat fire all right so my spyware and virus protection is on um, this software is um, functioning like this hitman pro 3.5 um, the only difference is, is that um, they are this one is free and this one is not free. So you get news. You can watch news here of the latest threats uh, today. So the latest threats to threat today is could fix the crypto for this 2.0, which was released from by May 3, 2010, and you can just start the scan until the scanner will, will quickly scan um, certain case of your system where they're at typically hide or it will scan um, the most um, common directory where viruses um, stays in so full scan performs a comprehensive in-depth scan of your entire system this run this scan regularly to protect your system I recommend this running um, once a week or or twice a week depending on your frequency of using um, the internet or downloading something like that and this is just a root, ski, root kit scan and you will see the tab here PC tools antivirus this will you will have to um, download the free edition of the PC tools antivirus and you can just click here download and no, we're not going to do that because I already combined it with a vest so threat control data injected to another program see program files this space that space let's say it's not a virus um it sometimes it um notifies you some false positive positive about um certain programs this displays all the items you ask Threadfire to always allow. If you no longer to wish to allow a particular item, select appropriate entry and click remove to remove it from the list. Denied. This will list the process that you have just denied or prevent it from running. Quarantine. Um, malware that has been quarantined may be managed here. Re restore permanently an item. By selecting in the list or clicking on for right below. Protection lag. You can just watch what happened here. And as you can see, uh, Windows 10 installer allowed, 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 allowed. So, um, just want to tell you not, not all of the programs that it has been detected are all viruses. Like this desk space. Um, desk space is a program that allows you to use a 3 3D cube just like in Ubuntu so I'm going to go to advanced options advanced rules settings and you can just change the rules here just be careful um, you can just click protect host file protection um, host file list or list of um, sites that um, tells your computer where to go and where not to go to for example, you want to go to um, facebook.com and you have just blocked it in the host file so it will not um, go, to, go to that site. Uh, you 
can see this process list uh, it's uh, very understandable system activity monitor but wait, wait it loads up and there you go um, this displays the recent programs that you have just um, played up or or use and displays um, the activity here um, including the modules, program actions, file actions and process data settings um, be careful when you change the settings here um, you can just change the sensitivity activity level to 5 which is the highest and we're gonna do that and do that in default which is a good one check for updates on protection program language notices um, threat fire protection and you can just turn off the system restore point um, threat fire can automatically reset a system restore point before you perform any quarantine actions so this is where um, our review for threat fire um, ends and thanks for watching and please don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe. Thank you.